Flower Store 2 here, June 23rd, 2015. As you know, I'm getting tired of doing these, but gotta keep pushing on, pushing on. So in part one we did Audrey, James, and part of, and then in part two we did Vanessa, Austin, and part of Austin actually. And then in part three we did the rest of Austin, Jace, and part of Clay. Then in part four we did the rest of Clay, then Steve, and part of Liz. Then in part five we did Liz, part the rest of Liz, Jason, and part of Shelly. Now we are in part six. We're gonna do the rest of Shelly. Then we've got Becca, John, and Meg to do. We'll see how that goes. Let's get this started. Okay, let's finish with Shelly. The reason Rachel had nothing to say at the end is because she hopes the girl doesn't win. Because usually she says, I hope you win to people she likes. Oh, I technically was already done with. Hmm. My bad. Moving on, moving on. I guess we didn't have to do the rest of her. Okay, let's go on to Becky. Yeah, Becky. And if you want to know Sills and Shills of Big Brother, link in the description. Go to Surviving Big Brother on Facebook. Okay, Becky. Yes, um, do you, what do I think of Shelly? I actually kind of like her. I'm not too sure about her, but she, I think she knows what she's doing. It goes back to her saying stuff about working, not work, working with girls never works, and then winning HRH not right away, you know, that's what got me to like her. So with Becky, wow, Rachel only likes her because she thought she was Rachel's fan. Like, basically, Rachel goes, So I heard you're my fan. And Ryan's like, No, she's not your fan, but she is Brandon's fan. And then Becky's like, No, 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 I'm Rachel's fan. And then Ryan's like, Well, on your notes, it says that you are a Brandon fan, that you wrote that you're a Brandon fan. And she's like, Okay, I'm a Brandon fan. But she's just trying to kiss Rachel's ass so that she was probably hoping that Ra they, that they didn't out her out about that because she doesn't want to get on Rachel's hit list to be on Twitter where she talks shit about her. So, yeah. She was a, she wants a show and a man. That's she wants. And then she thinks that the reason why she wants a show in a man is because Rachel had a show in a man and it worked out. And that usually when you have a show in a man, you have an extra person that's on your side, that's next to you, that helps you out in the game. No, that's not what happens. They get split up, they vote one of the sh show in a man out of the game, and they don't get to help out. Sorry, it's just not how it works. She watches. She watched two seasons of Big Brother and started loving the show. And she really got into it last year. And now she's obsessed with the show. Which is awesome. So she doesn't know who G. Joe is. And Rachel is not cheating for her. So therefore she hates her. Leave Rachel. Leave Rachel, we want the truth, blah, 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 blah. Then they asked Jeff and Jordan, and she said, love them. And Rachel was like, that's G. Joe. And she said, oh, never heard of that. She doesn't know Dr. Will. How can you not know who he is? And how can you love Janelle and Frankie? Ew. Now she asked about HOH, and she said she is not going to try and win the first week of HOH. Good plan. 
but for some reason I just I just don't like you and I don't know why moving on moving on next person which is John and I got lots to say about John and I will tell you this I don't like him and you'll see why so he is a dentist and will tell people and he's happy about that don't know why can't hardly understand what he's saying half the time he is talking and oh my god that will annoy the fuck out of me he basically mumbles when he talks he talks like this when you don't know what he's saying and the way he laughs is so annoying I just don't like him. I just don't. I see. Rachel hates him. She's not flirting with him. He says he's going to do to do no man things. He says HOH means power to him and should be HOH first week because they don't go home. Sorry to burst your bottle, John, but they do go home. If you are the first HOH, then they will go for you. And you will go home. And Major says he he's like Dan. She says, Oh my god, you look like Dan. Oh my god, you sound like Dan. Um Dan doesn't Dan Dan doesn't talk like that. Sorry, Dan doesn't talk like that. Dan when Dan talks, you understand a word he's saying. He's not mumbling. And then, um, I'm sorry, but Somebody put Dan and him together, side by side, and send it to me, or put it on my Surviving Big Brother page, or on Twitter at Real oh yeah Army, uh, tag me in it, because I want to see how she thinks, how that dumbass bitch, who's blind apparently, thinks those two look alike, because they don't. And Dan's likable. That's another reason. And Dan's not even his favorite. Caleb is. <laughs> he likes Frankie. He likes Evil Dick. And he likes Janelle. He doesn't know who G. Joe is. No one does. Then she cheats for him. But not the girls. Wow. He said season 11... He liked Jeff and Jordan. Wait. He likes, but in season 13, he hates Jeff and Jordan in season 13. When they're the same, so I don't know. He lied about Brandon and Rachel. He said, no, he hates. No, he hates, but added, not live with. Oh, what he's saying is, he's saying that, no, I don't want to live with you guys. But I think you were cool, but I don't want to live with you guys because you're annoying me too much. Dude, just say you hate them. So what if she talks shit about you on Twitter? You got fans that will back your ass up, maybe. Then again, no, you don't have fans to back you up because nobody likes you because you're mumble. So yeah, he laughs. His laugh is so annoying. Yeah. I hope he leaves first week. I'm sorry. He's worse than Meg. Okay, it looks like I can talk about Meg. Which is good to know. Probably not talk about her the whole time. So yeah, you'll see why she's laughing. Why she annoys me. I already had her from a commercial. How is Frankie her favorite? How, then again, she's annoying like Frankie. She thinks she's going to get a flirt man. Yeah, okay. She is not going to get a flirt man. Once she starts talking and acting all crazy and stuff, nobody's going to want to be with her. Sorry. She thinks her crazy... Okay, when I said the other person thought her craziness was... She could hide that, blah, blah, blah. I really meant her. I don't know how I got them confused. I am so sorry about that. Why ask about 
if she likes Frankie when you talked about her liking Frankie already. You annoy annoying ass. Can't like Dan and Frankie. Yeah, she likes Dan and Frankie, which is weird. She doesn't want to tell Rachel that she hates her and Brandon, so she doesn't know what to say on it. Laugh out loud on that. Well, duh. She would like to know. They're both annoying. I'm glad she stopped asking who G. Joe is to people. I mean, it took the last person and all. She likes Survivor. She thinks people will want to work with her. No first out, I hope. Meaning, I hope she's first out. Nobody's going to like her. So, that is it for Big Brother. And let me just say that tomorrow I have to work, so I'm going to have to miss an hour of Big Brother. So, if you join me on Big Brother, on Surviving Big Brother, I will have a post. You guys during the show can talk about Big Brother there and what you think while you're watching it. And then when I get home, whoever, if you comment, I will give you a shout out saying thanks for, I will give you a shout out saying thanks for, um, commenting during the show. This is what so-and-so said. This is what so-and-so said. And so on. And I will start commenting once I get home at 8 o'clock. And then the 7 to 8 that I've missed, I will then rewatch the... I, not rewatch it. I will watch that. And while I'm watching that, I will comment on that as well. Um, basically, me commenting during the show and stuff is just me writing down different notes for the video. Okay? For the actual video that I will be making at night. Now at 9 o'clock I have catfish. So I probably won't get to the video until 10. And yes, I'll be off Skype and everything while I'm watching the video because i got to focus. So from 10 to 11 I will watch the 7 o'clock that I have missed. And I probably won't have a video until after that at 11. So 11 Central Standard Time is when you'll see a video from me. Sorry. That's just how it has to work. Thanks for listening and thanks for watching. I'm sorry this has to be the part when I can only do 15 minutes of video. But I will talk to you all later. And I would love to know in the comments what you think of each person that I've talked about. Bye!